looking now. Are okay, yeah, we're yeah, going. Go ahead. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, this thing's cool. Oh, yeah. Here's to the Royal Jager Channel. Royal Jager Channel. Yeah, they understand him. Yeah, she's in Denver right now with my family. She's, you, you got, she's already working this day. I'm going to do something this week because we have I have four days off this yeah. weekend. I said I'm not going to hang out. In Denver. Okay, guys. So that was the uh, black, the black. Uh, what was that called? The black, black lion. The that black lion. lion. And uh, we've it's picked. Kevin, uh, it's Kevin the American. Yeah, we, we've picked up an American <laughs> straggler uh, along the way. And uh, <laughs> Hold on, I'll put my face on this window. Give me a picture. <laughs> and uh, now it's time to get something to eat. So uh, let's, uh, let's see what we can find. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Okay. Oh my God. Oh man, what a great evening! Eh? I tell you what. Oh. We couldn't have picked a better tour. Could we? Fantastic. Oh, it's fantastic. The tour was great. Fantastic. Great. Great tour guide, great people we met, including you, Kevin. Oh, no, thank you, thank you so much. No, no, but it's been great, isn't it? <laughs> how many people, how many tours have you been on and you've gone for a drink after the people? Right, no. Never. See? Oh, I'm so hungry though, I could eat, I could eat, oh, yeah. I could eat a horse. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't know when. So we're, we're, we're trying to find a uh, curry house now, and we've uh, walked about I don't know, it's not, not that far, miles. but about two miles down the wrong way, two down the street. Two drugs. So, uh. Look at the big chick. Oh, they're open here. Uh, the Anna Purna. Oh, wow. Were you underdressed? To rats day three, a um, bit gloomy today, but um, still nice. Uh, we've got a fun packed day for you today, and it is for you because I mean, we don't get it's quite hard work for us. Well, uh, just a lovely little breakfast that should uh, the Starbucks and set us up for the day for a little bit of drinking. And now we're just gonna off to uh, the city of York. We're on the way walking to it, we um and sort of tranquil garden just like off of, off a of busy high street and as you can see there it's a lovely wild carol garden here and it's hard to live in central London you've got a little quiet area like this you can just sit and have a chat and, and just a nice sort of tranquil place this building here has literally got all this stuff growing up in it's really amazing you see here the architecture yeah brilliant metropolitan line at all gate and this is uh one of the newer trains that have really got a press section, I don't know if Mark's was to film it. This is really real, it's not like an area, just I think I'm a bit of an anorak talking about trains on a real hour channel. <laughs> but, I don't know if I'm up about filming this. <laughs> I'll leave you down here then. Yeah, leave you down here, yeah. to the city of York but that is um, this building here now I don't have anything to do with it but I could be certainly wrong here but my dad used to smoke um, a roll up tobacco called Old Holborn and the front of the packet was built I think ah okay yeah and I think 
well, but I look in tomorrow when I get home, but um, lovely old building. I don't know yeah, how it is, yeah. Unless the place is all it dates back to. I'd say it's probably like Tudor. Yeah, so this is turning into architecture, trains, and ale. Kind of. <laughs> <laughs> it's a mixed bag. Um, no, a mixed bag. Building, building. Okay, uh, get a half. Right, on the city of York. City of York. Good, isn't it? Amazing, isn't it? Hello. Wow. There we go. A couple of halves of Samuel Smith's. Oh, should be good because uh, it uh, took some effort to pour it. I think. So. I bet it's the first one of the day, isn't it? I think. This is, um, I think, it's uh, Samuel uh, Smith's um, own pub in uh, 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 Yorkshire. I think they're Yorkshire's oldest brewer. Um, where they used to meet um, solicitors and lawyers, and they used to meet their um, clients for the legal representation, oh, right. yeah, and yeah, courts yeah, and stuff. Yeah. And, uh, um, yeah, uh, I've just been reading up actually in the, in the book about this and uh, the, you're right, this is uh, um, where the lawyers used to meet clients before going into court so they can insult each other and get their stories straight. So, uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's just a amazing place, I'm a little film around. Just a lovely little building. I don't think it's as old as what it looks like, is it Marcus? I think it's only, I think it's made to look old, but it's not as old as it looks, the building. It's really, really lovely. You can go. Got a piece of dartboard in. Yeah, Marcus, look at this. Really old fireplace. We've got the. We've got all the different great different sides, you see. Because we keep doing one from each angle. I wonder if I even like this. I think I do. Just, uh, I think this building is great to listed. It's just really, really well designed and set out. Imagine this on a Friday night, being really packed. Yeah, they don't like it anymore. Not anymore, but it used to. Yeah. Oh wow! So it is. Yeah. Uh, I think. Um, Imagine standing around that. Yeah. <laughs> Double the party will be. Right, little um story okay. behind uh, wheat beer. Um, as you can tell, wheat beer. Now, many years ago, I'm not claiming to laugh about beer now, but when I'm even less than I know now, I um got a wheat beer bought for me. Someone brought it over to me, and I sat there, sat there, sat there, kept thinking it's going to clear. And uh, my friend uh, you know, said to me, "What are you waiting for?" I said, I'm waiting for it to clear, he goes, it's a wheat beer, it won't clear. And then he explained to me, um, wheat beer is all still like that, so you can be sitting all day and never clear. Well, let's give this a try then. Um, not like this before, so. It's uh, 5%. Mm, it's got a nice smell to it, isn't it? Sweet, isn't it? Yeah, it's a like sweet, sweet smell. Yeah. 
It's it, kind of. It, I'll tell you what. It's, it actually smells a bit like cider. Bit. Got a kind of sweet smell. It doesn't feel like it's a mass-produced beer, and it's quite a sweet taste. But it's very nice. It's really refreshing, actually. Mm. Still has some clear gear. <laughs> Very good. That's his um, this wheat beer. You're right, Mark. It's a really, really sweet smell to it. Let's give it a bit of taste. Yeah. Oh, cool. Tell you what, right? If you want a real chilled, refreshing drink, but you don't fancy a lager. This is brilliant, you know. So I don't think it's a bit outside of art. I'm getting it's a mixture of lager and bitter together. Yeah, yeah like yeah. lager and ale together. It's refreshing, it's like, yeah. It's very, really refreshing, I'll tell you. Yeah. Real hot day, I think. I'd love to have this. Yeah, cheers. This one's a bit of a glass. The camera, the camera, it's a lovely glass. Really fun, yeah. You get it? Yeah. Okay guys, well that was the city of York. Yeah. Uh, now we're going on to the next one, which is just up the road. So uh, we'll take it there now. Let's go.